I'm Dr. Nicholas Ting, and I'm a fellowship trained and board certified adult hip and knee surgeon here at Dixon Dively Orthopedics. Robotic assisted hip and knee surgery involves getting a pre-surgical CAT scan of your affected joint so that we have a very detailed three-dimensional depiction of your joint. We then do all of our pre-surgical planning, the size of your implants, the cuts that we make, we then have a robotic arm in surgery, which allows us to execute those pre-planned measurements and cuts to a T. We can correlate what we see in surgery with what we planned in the CAT scan before surgery so that we know that when we implant those components, they fit each patient like a glove. Hip and knee replacements are two of the most reproducible and successful things that we do in all of medicine which is saying quite a lot. The introduction of robotic assisted surgery offers us a new level of precision and accuracy to an already very successful group of procedures. I think the most important part in your surgery is having a surgeon who is well trained and experienced in that type of surgery, but certainly having the assistance of robotics gives that surgeon a new level of accuracy and precision that even experience can't duplicate. There are a lot of ways that we can measure success in the surgeries that we do, whether it's by getting into the nitty gritty of how much they're able to bend and straighten their knee following surgery, or how quickly they get off of a cane or a walker. But I think the best way of measuring success is the stories that I get from my patients, whether it's getting a former championship level racquetball player back to championship form, or getting a mom or a grandmother back to playing with their kids and grandkids and taking them to soccer, I think the latter is probably the best way of measuring success, and that's the one that matters the most.